Hey there everybody, it's Peter from Indigo River Tiny Homes and my lovely wife Christina is running the camera. Hey y'all. We're here today to show you our latest model which is a 10 foot wide by 36 foot long, 13 and a half foot tall Rambler Deluxe model. It's being delivered down to Austin, Texas next week. It's got some great custom features on it and let's go check them out. Let's start on the outside first, show you a few things that we do that you're not going to see with other builders. Uh, first is the outdoor storage shed on the rear of the house. We call this the bike shed because it's just tall enough to fit a bike in and you can probably fit about four or five bicycles in there uh, or whatever else you want. And we've got the tankless wa water heater mounted in here. That pipe over there is for the dryer. So tons of storage in, in the rear of the house here. There's a water filter, that's standard. And then the tankless hot water heater is an upgrade. And so this is the space underneath the landing in the deluxe loft upgrade. So if you get the deluxe loft, 99% of the time you get that storage right. underneath, depending on you know your own preferences and what you order. Yep, and we've so, got the mini split system on the back here, and and we have another one up front. We'll show you, and this is also where the electrical connection and the and the breaker box is. On the outside of the house here, we did board and batten on the exterior, which is my favorite type of siding. Um, we got an exterior outlet. This is a, a custom upgrade as well. It's got a low profile exterior water spigot and it's got a special attachment you put on your water hose that you plug in there and it comes on. So it's really cool. So it, it's nice, nice and sleek looking. You don't have the regular hose bib sticking out the side of your house. We got the additional mini split unit here on the front. And then huge storage closet on the front of the house. It's about eight feet of ceiling height in there. So you can store tall items. A lot of people put their brooms in there. Some people put their kayaks in there. Got shelves on the sides so you can store whatever you need to, electrical outlets. So you can plug in if you got anything that needs to be plugged in in there. Rechargeable vacuum. Let's go on inside the house, take a look at the interior features. Before we do, we'll take, check out the door. It's got a keypad lock on it and blinds between the glass. We always do out swing doors on our houses. They seal better against the weather and water infiltration. So y'all, some of y'all might remember this layout. This um, customer wanted a house almost exactly like the Casablanca that we built before. Just a couple of changes. It's nice and quiet in here. All right, let's start out in the kitchen. So you've got a huge upgraded kitchen in this house. It's got, these are quartz countertops with the eat at bar. And underneath the bar there, you want to show the storage under there or? Showing the bar. Okay. <laughs> the countertop. That's pretty nice. Yeah, they, they saw the storage when I was here okay. before. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Showing it again. We've got the uh, pull-out pantry. You probably have to come around this. I'm going to go get it from here. There we okay. go. Okay. Yeah, so it's got a huge pull-out pantry with several uh, shelves inside of it. And it's, and it's that deep, about 18 inches wide. That's the uh, biggest one we've ever built, I think. I so. think so. It's definitely the widest this way. Yeah. Um, we've done taller ones, but... Uh, got the four drawers down below, apartment size fridge with storage above and below the fridge. And this customer opted for a full size propane oven range. So it's got the griddle in the middle and four burners on the sides and full size oven. You can cook whatever, whatever you want to in there. Jealous of that griddle. And, yeah. And we've got the, the corner cabinet with the lazy Susan inside so you can uh, access, make make that corner section functional. Uh, we've got the, this is our standard stainless steel sink. It's 28 inch wide sink, very deep, has these accessories that come with it. It's got a ledge inside for a drying rack. That rolls up. Cutting board, this rolls up. And then uh, also a little rinsing pan where you can use that for drying as well. Our standard pull down faucet, matte black. Looks beautiful with the two, with the double casement window above. Those crank out. And then uh, lots of storage. We've got the toe kick drawers. 
underneath. We do this in almost all of our houses uh, where we have the toe kick drawers for use every inch of space that we can. Then super secret. Super secret. Shh. <laughs> for all your super secret stuff. And then we have a surprisingly deep dishwasher. Is that's it? like more than half of a regular dishwasher. I think some of them yeah. are just like about half, but that seems... Yeah, this one goes goes way down. They have the, the, the sprayers and everything are really low profile, so the drawer is almost full depth of that, of the height of that dishwasher. Right. So now we're walking so I'm going to little... just get a view of the windows and the... And the TV mounts up there as well. Oh, so yeah, that's where the TV will go. Right across from the sofa. So it's a nice, generous living area. So you got a bunch of stuff, I mean, a bunch of space there. And then we one, just got our little sample. One feature in this house is we did some built-in speakers. The customer wants some Bluetooth speakers built into the house. Okay. Uh, so there's a couple down here and there's a couple up in the bedroom. And then is this to hook that, up? Yeah, that's the controller. Okay. So in Casablanca, the bathroom was not finished because the customer wanted to finish it herself. But in this one, this one's called Sweet Melissa. Mm -hmm. This yep. one, we finished the bathroom. You got a floor to ceiling linen cabinet straight ahead when you walk in. Five foot wide by 32 inch deep front to back. Uh, walk in shower, sliding glass doors and a removable shower head. Vessel sink on the vanity. So is she going to have a separate dryer yeah, back she, in the corner? Yeah, so she's going to have a dryer, and it's actually going to face this way. So she's going to have to have a stool or something to get on, get down there and load the clothes, but she'll have her washer on this pedestal and the dryer back there in the okay. corner. And it's going to be a gas dryer. And now you can see the railing a little bit better. This is pretty. And these are just the touch open. Right, yeah, the push open. What, what do you call that? Cabinet. Push open? Push open, uh huh. <laughs> I want a plug in there. Yep, electrical outlets. We always put electrical outlets in there. So if you have anything you want to stow away that needs to be charged. There's our yeah. carbon monoxide, right? Yep. Detector. All right, here's our giant stand up loft. And we did a swing we're back around here real quick because. I wanted to point out the black stain on the on the stair treads and the railing here that we did to match the, the flooring the customer chose. This is a laminate flooring, or actually it's a vinyl plank flooring, which normally has a wood grain look. This one ha has a tile look, a black tile look that the customer chose. And so we've got a king size bed platform with shelving. Um, on one side, there's the got the step up for step up here, step up here, and then like a built in bedside table. Yep, lots of full, full length hanging, half hanging, and some drawers. And then y'all can see this is a ton of floor space here. I'll come around here, and Peter can stand. Yeah, I can so, yeah. Wonder Woman in this space. This is definitely lots of floor space in here. I can mm -hmm. do yoga right here. You can do yoga, have put a little chair here if you want. Mm -hmm. um, we've got the additional mini split head in here. She likes it very cool when she sleeps. And then there's the other built in speakers above the shelves there. So a great layout, I think. All right, go ahead. You can go on back down. Is All that right. everything? I think that's everything. We, I mean, you might want to point out the ceiling fan while you're up there at sky yeah, level. Well, it's not as cute from up here. <laughs> see if I can... And we got the, the three pendant lights. Got the two hanging over the, the bar here and one over the kitchen sink. The accent wall. We didn't say anything about that. Yeah, the accent wall and then the custom built um, vent hood over the range. Yeah, that's pretty. Uh, the cabinets on one side and the open shelving on the other. So totally custom for this this customer's taste and we hope you like it too because she loves it <laughs> and we love you thanks for tuning in thanks we'll for see y'all next time
Oh yeah, and subscribe. Be sure to click and subscribe. We've, we're trying to get all of our houses up on the YouTube channel, so subscribe and hit the notification bell. Do they still have that? Oh, they do. <laughs> They've got that. All right. See y'all later. Bye.